All right, check this out, guys. It's Tuesday, and I'm home. I'm gonna be going to work today, guys. So, you know, I'm gonna have to cut this real quick. But I was here messing around some of my stuff I have here in the room, and I came across an item I think I should really show you guys. So, without further ado, guys, let me go into my vault right here. This thing is like a time capsule. Now, for the people who are probably wondering that my channel is new and they only see like 63 subscribers, I was making videos a long time ago, guys. Long before I was doing videos on YouTube. And I was using this. So what I'm saying, this right here is my first camera ever. I had this thing in like maybe, I think it's like 2001 or 2002, one of those years. And I used to use it to record on tape. See that right there? This is from 2005. I think this is the last recording I've ever done. It was a barbecue back in Jamaica and 2005. That's when I record this. And it's the high eight, eight millimeter type tapes. And these, I think it was like some somewhat digital format, even though it's tape, it was coded. So the quality was real good. And that's what they recorded on. Well guys, this camera right here, now I want you to really see this. Let me put it up here, by the way. This thing had a selfie screen. It's funny how some cameras now don't. And then these companies expect you to vlog with them. Look at the Sony right here. Bam, you flip that out. See that? Now imagine if you were vlogging like 15, 20 years ago. It would look like this. But this thing was nice, guys. Back then, I was the man when I had this. I was recording videos all the time and I would just take it home, plug it up to the TV and I'd watch my videos. It was a lot of fun, guys. Every party I used to go to, I usually walk with this and people were like, just impressed to see me walking around with something like this because I was the only dude on my block that owned one of these. I can tell you that much. I was way ahead of my time back then with technology because I was the only one that got one of these. And I was doing videos and stuff of parties. People would come to me like, can you come bring your camera to my party and just do a video for me? And it's funny, I was, I'm a music person. I never took the video side of things seriously. And after so many years of just ignoring this stuff or just taking this stuff for fun, it's funny now that things have become way more advanced that I finally figured out how to edit video in a digital format because I have, look at this computer right here. Look at the setup, multiple screens. So I have way more than I need to actually edit video, but only if I had applied, and at 115, yep. If only I had applied that knowledge, or at least the interest in editing video from when I was doing this stuff right here, even though it wouldn't be that pretty though, because I would have to run an analog cable to a computer Get a video card with a AV input and try to do something with it then. Well guys, here I am, man. After so many years of messing around with this, I put it away. I still kept it because I have the tapes and I know the tapes work. Look at that. There's a tape inside of here. So what I'm saying? So I have one more tape inside. And this tape has probably got some stuff on it as well. I don't think it's empty. But it's funny how over time, we put this stuff away and then technology just started to speed up so fast. Now we can do quality videos on a cell phone because I'm using the Note 8 here and look at the quality we're getting off of it, guys. So what I'm saying? So it's just funny how time flies and how sometimes you have 
a sign of what you can become right in your hand, but never know it. Because here I am running a YouTube channel and working my way up to get to my numbers that I need for YouTube to really recognize my, my work here. But this camera is helping me tell my story of my whole life, not just on the YouTube side and about video, but all of this from the music stuff, the DJing stuff, to me over here on the drum machine making beats and stuff, guys. It's just really telling my whole life. All right? So, it's better late than never. That's why I always say. And at least I preserve the camera so I can show it to you guys that. Just practice and Study your craft sometimes. Life can actually give you a hint of what you really want to become. But then when you're young, you ignore it. You don't take anything seriously. I had that camera for so long. If only I was really interested in doing the video part of things, I would have been so far ahead. I would have started my channel and have videos years ago. I only figured this stuff last year and I got the idea from someone at my job. So I could have really moved on from this to maybe a better camera and started putting videos up years ago, but I never, never considered it, guys. But as I said before, it's better late than never, man. Now, though, I'm having fun. Now that I've discovered how to do this stuff here, guys, I'm having fun. I'm enjoying myself. And I love doing videos for you guys every single day, man. That way, as I said, I get to tell my story and I get to have you guys travel along with me through my journey in my present day state here. That way I get to express all of my new technology. I get to show off the new stuff. And I know people appreciate this stuff because a lot of people who are watching me right now are from back in Jamaica. And a lot of them can't afford any of this stuff here. But at least I keep hope alive inside of them by showing them that I'm still keeping up that trend of having the coolest gear. Because that's how I was doing it back home. All right? So guys, I gotta go to work, man. It's a Tuesday, I have to go to work at three o'clock. So I'm gonna have to pick up Asha and get back here, get ready for work. So thanks once again for joining me. For the people who are new, if this is your first time before you leave, remember to hit the subscribe button. And if you want, you can also hit the notification bell. That way you know when my videos are up and you can be early. And just help me spread the word and build the channel, all right? So guys, I'm gonna end it as usual. Peace and salute from West Palm Beach. And I'm out of here. And I'll see you guys tomorrow, man. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Peace.